Hello everyone, and today we're going to win Sonic Speed Slayer. We are finally catching Sonic the Hedgehog. And you're probably wondering why, why right? We're going to do tag. Yeah, that is so cool, right? We're actually going to do tag. See, there's little footprints. And, you know, like, what is this update about? Yeah, what is this update about? Well, let's check out the update. So, in this update, you're going to have to get memory tokens. And you're probably wondering what they are. Well, I will tell you soon, but first, Sonic, what happened to you? Please help, I can't break this thing. All I heard was a voice that said, Collect enough memory tokens to free your friend. Yeah, weird. And, you know, you can... And if you collect enough memory tokens, if you collect 50, Cyber Energy Trail, if you collect 75, a Sprout Coco, if you collect 100, you get two Sprout Cocos. If you collect 150, you get three Sprout Cocos. And then, Frontiers Sonic. I know, that is that is really cool. Like, I really want to be fronted. Okay, everyone. So, this is cyberspace. And here is Sonic getting trapped. What do you got to say? It appears Sonic is trapped in this cage somehow. The only way to get him out appears to be by collecting enough memory tokens by completing in the cyberspace theme tag. So, what is tag? You're probably wondering. Well, so, we all know tag. You know, like, tag, tag, tag. But this is with Sonic the Hedgehog. So, you you have to have at least, like, 16 players. If you don't, um, at the end of the timer, everyone, you know, like, you can get in. And the rules. Like, the worst thing ever. The rules. Get the most tags to win. Easy. Team switch sides once per life game. Easy. Tag plays by catching them or using a homing attack when they're close. Oh. Cool. Now we wait. Okay, we are back. So, I'm gonna spawn in and look where we are. Could be tagger. Yep, so I'm a tagger. You see the orange dudes, they're runners. So the tagger's job is to get runners. So it should be that it should be pretty simple, right? It's not as simple as you think. Yep, I just got a tag. So it, you see up here, tags are memory tokens. So yeah, you just gonna have to get as much tags as you can. You can either walk through them or like double jump on them if you want to get a tag. Depends. And there should be about an even amount of taggers and runners. So don't worry if like you like you're like you're a new person on tagger and everyone else is runner. Yeah, don't worry about that. I'm pretty sure that that actually has happened to me. Probably would be a glitch, but hey. So you're just gonna have to run around. Get as much people as you can. And so right now I'm just gonna show you like about the map and what you have to do. Then I'll show you some tips and tricks. So, let's see how we go. Okay, everyone, so now we are runners. So, it is like technically the opposite. You can have to run away from all the taggers, try to be as fast as you can, don't let anyone die. Yeah, so if you get tagged, you just respawn back and, you know, like try to get as away as you can from all the taggers, cause like you want to win. Like, the main thing is win. Actually, it's kind of having fun, but like, who doesn't like to win? So, once both teams have been run and tagged, the game ends, and you can redo it. So, now let's see how we go. Well, guys, so far, you know, like, they've tagged more people than us, so that's kind of bad. And now you restart the game. Yep, it says right here how much you got if you just saw, and now you can replay. So this time I'm gonna tell you some good tips and now we just wait until like the next game. Okay, we are here. Now I'm gonna tell you the tips and tricks. So I am Tagger. So for Tagger, if you ever see like a person that you need to get, they're probably just gonna be running as fast as you can. Like you see, this person is running as fast as they can. Still can't catch them and they're gonna be like that. They're just gonna keep doing that. You know how they do. You, you know what they should do? 
Okay, so, so let's see this dude. So, try to find a person, and you see them running away. Try to cut corners so you know where they're going. Like, let's do this, and then I'm closer to them. Try to cut corners, they're pretty easy. Like, pretend, yeah, there's a person like over here, like right over there, and you wanna get them. Keep cutting corners till you get really close to them. Then you can just tag them. Yeah, it's pretty simple. So that's my advice for being a tagger. It's not the best advice, but it's actually really helpful. I'm not gonna lie. Like seriously, I I done this a few times and I got like 10, 10 tags from doing this. So now let's wait until I get the roll runner. Okay, everyone, I am the roll runner. So what you wanna do? You can just sit here. I know. I know that's kind of weird. Like, what are you doing when people can get you? So if anyone comes and gets you, let's just say a blue person comes and gets me, one of the taggers, and anyone going to come? Yep, that blue dude runners, taggers get trying to get me. Yep, that person just tried to get me, but I just roll. So that's some really good ways. Or you can find a magical hiding spot, like, right here. And no one will see you. Yep, some just saw me. Total scan. So that's my, like, that's what I say you should try to do. It's some good advice. And, like, yeah. Let's see if, if we get any good, like, things. Memory tokens. So here, memory tokens. That's how much we got. And I'm going to tell you, like, best characters to use for this. Okay, so the best characters are... Where Hulk, Knuckles, and of course Sonic. So that's all I'm gonna have to say for today, and I'm just gonna say it. Please like and subscribe, and have a great one.